funny because every day he came to work, he tried to get me to come to the crib, and I'm glad I didn't go. Cause seeing him, seeing him do that, I ain't gonna lie. Outside influence, outside influence plays sometimes it plays a part in your life. Seeing him do that shit, like slacking, I probably would have slacked. But I know, like, that's why I kept telling them I don't want to go all the way to the Bronx. I walk to work every day, so that's my motivation. I get up, smoke an L, watch TV for a little bit. Then I look outside. My motivation is really when I look outside. I look outside, I see everybody going somewhere. So the other day I came out of my building, and my nigga was like, where you going? Early in the morning, I was like, to work. That shit felt good as hell to say that shit, yo. I swear. You just see niggas just sitting around doing nothing. They ain't getting no bread. They just outside. They ain't even hustling. And for me to walk by and say, I'm going to work, man. He said, well, that's what's up, yo. And then as I noticed, as I'm going to work, everybody's going somewhere. Like, I'm like, damn, I'm glad I'm back in the rush, man. I'm glad I'm back in the game because I could have been sleeping till 1 o'clock, getting up, bullshitting, going to see who we got bud, whatever. Word. I was, it felt good the other morning to say, you know, I'm going to work. It was like 7 o'clock. We went, word? You ain't tell me you work? I've been working all week, man. saying that the other day, he said, but your mentality is different from his. See, he played video games and still shit. Your mentality is, yo, I need this bread, I'm getting up, I'm gone. He said, even after the day, he said, you're going, if you went back the next day, he know for sure right there that, yeah, this dude is serious. He could have stayed at home today and been like, fuck it. But he actually came back. I'm going to show you this shit on YouTube now. You gotta type in Hollywood Streets featuring what's your name? Sunny Sarga. Sunny. Sunny. Oh, it's your Sunny Saga Freestyle. That's it. That's all the all you gotta put in. Somebody coming back there. I need no more back there. Oh, it was something. Oh, you got it. Tiger comes right up. You know what, though? You want to help me get a lot of shit done, man. Because everybody be telling me, yo, I look for this shit on YouTube all the time, man. You don't got none of that music up there? None of them mixtapes or nothing? Damn, son. If you had that shit up there, I know you would have got the time about it. I just told niggas, I'm about to do mixtape with my man from work. <clears throat> Word. Around but you heard me, you heard my, I have you heard, I let you hear him on my songs? What you think? What you think? What do you think? All right, all people always tell me I sound certain, but I want to hear what you're going to tell me. What, what, how do I sound? What's my deliverance? Because you know a lot about music, so tell me about me. You ain't really, really hear nothing because I got my album, but from what you heard, from what I heard, this shit is good. You know what it is? And to be honest, it's probably like me. Like, I feel like sometimes if I do a whole lot of songs by myself, I'll be feeling like I need, I need to animate it more. Like, I'll change, I do different voices. Me too. Shit. Like, I got this, this one thing. You know, Jada got that. Ah my shit is WCMS. I always say that shit. WCMS. I say that shit in all my shit. Niggas be like, what's in the w reception down in the basement of the shit. What's no WCMS? I be like, world class music. He's like, oh. I be like, but really, WCMS came from a station that my father used to listen to in Virginia when I was a kid. My father's favorite radio station used to be WCMS. Years later, the name of my group is called World Class. WCMS, world class music. 
I was like, everything that I went through in my life, it has something to do with my music. Like, I rap. My mother's initials is R-A-P, Ruth Dan Page. Rap. <clears throat> N.W.A. used to be my favorite group. Right. I didn't even know Dr. Drake's first group was called the World Class Wrecking Crew. The name of my yeah, crew was called World yeah. Class. That's true, because he, uh, he, was, he had an interview, because I watched a lot of interviews. The name of my crew was called World Class. Dre is going to do my album. He's going to want to fuck with me just because of the fact that, damn, this nigga named his crew World Class. The name of my first crew was World Class. World Class Wrecking Crew. But our name used to be executive class. But then we, one day we were doing a mixtape. And I did this, I did this song called World Class. And ever since then, I was like, yo, we're gonna change the name to World Class. Chant real good. Hmm? You can chant on some on some Booja Bonta, Sean, Sean. Yeah, I got songs doing. I got reggae songs. I don't just rap regular. I do reggae songs too. I'm gonna let you hear. I'm gonna let you hear. I, I got this like, one oh, song. Wow. I be I be um chanting shit. I'll be like, put down the dupes. The boss falls back in the vicinity. My middle finger goes to all my enemies. You open that. My last single is done. But I'm gonna let you hear one right now. Favoritism check, F you check, if you don't know the rules, you're an active neck. Seriously, get at Murphy, get at Murphy for your funny shit. The rap will sing both the way I'm running shit. The top shotter, you hear me? The boss man, I yet to Brooklyn the king with more fire. Yo, play pussy hole and I boom, bye bye, it's time to be up. <laughs> Medallion with brother, you need to get high. You're not rough for eye. No test, no try. Tell me, I could get your heart tipping like dudes who play a fool. I survived this sin. I am bad news. I push with secrets. Now everybody knows that loyalty and discipline and what's the only way. Word. I know, because I don't know some songs. I got this one song. To this one song. Oh, um, this one reggae beat.